It's Monday, May 6, 2024. This is CBS News Mornings. Breaking overnight, Israel begins evacuating Palestinian civilians from Rafah. A signal a ground invasion could be imminent. The move comes after the latest ceasefire talks end in another stalemate. Waterlogged, more rain, flash floods, scenes of despair. And now a new threat is moving across the country's midsection. And surfing trip tragedy. An American and two Australians killed in the Baja Peninsula. The motive, the arrest, and the surprising discovery. Well, good morning and good to be with you. I'm Anne-Marie Green. We start with breaking developments out of the Middle East. The Israeli military is starting to move civilians out of a section of Rafah, the southern Gaza City, where more than a million Palestinians sought refuge from the war. Israel says they are directing the people to an expanded humanitarian area that includes field hospitals, tents, food, water, and other supplies. Israel has been vowing to invade Rafah for months now to weed out the remaining Hamas militants. And the move comes Hurried at first, but now they're welcoming their new bee neighbors. It is beautiful and it is refreshing to see it. I like it. I like it a lot. Helping bees helps us restore a little bit of nature in the city. Michael George, CBS News, New York. Coming up on CBS Mornings, Formula One racing champ Lewis Hamilton sits down for an exclusive interview with Gail King about his massively emotional journey during his final season with Mercedes. Plus, Blue Bloods actor Tom Selleck discusses his new memoir, You Never Know. And Cedric the Entertainer joins us in the Times Square studio with an exclusive preview of the final season of The Neighborhood. That's CBS News Mornings for this Monday. You can catch me on CBS 24-7, streaming throughout the morning for all your latest news. News. Thanks for watching. I'm Anne Marie Green. Have a great day.